box. It's time to put the good in your morning. You're watching the KOAM Morning News on Fox 14. Today, Stormy Farms stops by the studio. Today, it's going to feel like it's in the low 90s, but uh, we're going to dive into the rest of the work week and look at these numbers we're throwing up in the Skywatch Weather Center. We got treats and we got meats from Stormy Farms, and we've got peppers for Pepper Fest coming up at the Joplin Empire Market. KOAM Morning News on Fox 14 starts now. You, you've started this farm from scratch. Yes. What does that mean? I mean, it says it on your website. We are a farm from scratch. Explain. Yes. We started with a house that was unlivable. 78 acres that was undesirable. This is like mid-2017? Yes. So, okay. Yes. And we started coming up here every weekend on our days off to be able to get the house ready for us to live in January 1st. We moved to Carthage. Where were you before? Uh, Kimberly City, Missouri. Okay. So we moved to Carthage and we started farming. Wow. What were you doing before that? I was a deputy sheriff. I was first a server. County. You were a server? Uh-huh. And so you found this land and, and you've turned it into something that is, I mean, I mean, clearly you've, you've got a brand, you've yes. got uh, you know, a business, you've got outreach at, at these farmers markets. I mean, yes. what has business been like? What have you found has really made things click? The farmers markets, definitely. Really? Yes, Absolutely. they are. Yeah, they are great when you're trying to be an up and coming business. Um, you get your name out there, you get your product out there, you get your, your logo out right. there, you know, so it's, um, it's very, it's very good for the community yeah. and for us to be able to help, kind of help each other. And the farmer's market is definitely the way to go if you're trying to get your name out there. Man. Well, I know we have some photos uh, from your, your Facebook page just popped up on, on Michael's Facebook. Uh, but I, I think it's amazing when you look at these photos and you sort of see your journey in timeline form. I mean, it, it's got to feel really good to see that progress made. Is there... Is there something you're you're aiming for that you might not be at right now as a business, or are you pretty much? Are you living oh, in, we have a lot of things. Big? There's a lot of things that we really are aiming for. We really want to be able to turn this into something that we can do solely, so she can actually quit her job. She doesn't have to go and, and be a server anymore. She can work the farm with with me because I work the farm full time. Yeah. She works two jobs. Hmm. So you're at which farmer's markets are you? At? We are at West City Farmer's Market on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and then we're at the Greater Springfield Market in Springfield at the Battlefield Mall on Saturdays. And is there any uh, is there any advice you have for someone who might be thinking, hey, I want to go to the farmer's market and check out what's going on because I'm, I'm starting, going to involved. I would start smaller, like at West City, and see kind of how you do. Yeah. And then, um, you know, the Greater Springfield Market is a great place to be as well. You, they're, both of them, I can't say enough about. They're, they're really nice people. They help us in a lot of ways, you know, help us get out there, help us, you know, they um, have used our product a couple of times at West City yeah. to, to, you know, here's the bacon, so, you know, and they picked up something and put it on, on their Facebook, you know, the, a new recipe with our product. It looks delicious. I've seen a few pictures of uh, just, I mean, even just the bacon. <laughs> it looks yeah. so good. So if people are wanting to contact you, uh, what is your website? It's stormyfarms.com? Yes. Simple and easy. Really appreciate you guys coming on and stopping by to talk to us about this. We're having people from Farmers Markets on all week, and you are a great way to kick things off, so we appreciate your time. Awesome. And uh, yeah, we'll be back here on the KOM Morning News on Fox 14. Awesome. We appreciate Thank it. Thank you.